Ford and Mount Mobile Auto Glass present high school basketball here tonight, the 2021 state semifinals as the Snowflake Lobos host the Falcons of Fountain Hills. And tonight it was a defensive struggle. So we take a look at this contest. On paper, it looked like these two teams were going to match up really well, and they did. In fact, it was a two-point lead for the Falcons at the end of the first quarter, a defensive struggle where Snowflake only scored one bucket in the first quarter. They had uh, several trips to the free throw line, but only one field goal in the first quarter, and they found themselves down 7-5. to five. At halftime, we were tied at 12, only 24 points scored by both of these teams in the first half. And uh, it, would look, it was looking like it was going to be a defensive struggle throughout the entire game. They got a little bit more aggressive offensively. A few more shots were able to fall in the second half for both of these teams. It was 25 to 24, the Falcons at the end of the third quarter. Snowflake had the lead about three or four times in the first three quarters, but other than that, it was mostly all Falcons until it mattered. Late in the fourth quarter, Snowflake spurred by Caden Brewer's 10 points and uh, Stuart West six points in the fourth quarter. They were able to get the lead at, in the final minutes of the contest. In fact, they scored, I believe it was around a minute 30 left in the contest where Snowflake regained the lead and they were able to hang on to that. They come away with the five point win here tonight, beating the Fountain Hills Falcons 40 to 35. We mentioned uh, Caden Brewer tonight. He scores 10. He's our Beal Orthodontic straight line play of the game as those 10 points accounted for the huge reason why Snowflake was able to win this contest. He got two uh, comfort fit dentures threes to give himself 10. Stuart West tonight had 12 total points, six in the first half and then six in the second half. Also, he was perfect from the free throw line with two quick free throws at the, uh, or two uh, three point plays, I should say to give himself six points in the fourth quarter and finishes the game with 12. He's our Alberto's hungry player of the game. Hats off to the Snowflake Lobos. They punched their ticket to the state championship game, which will be held at East Mark High School on Saturday at 5.30. Girls have already made it. Boys make it tonight. It's going to be a Snowflake final live from East Mark High School. We hope you join us here on italk1067 and italk1067.com. <laughs>